Almunia. Tahani, you have um, six unpaid parking tickets, and most of them, let's see, are, uh, they're all in the afternoon. They're all at parking meters. I have a ticket for uh, a year. I understand, but there's a parking meter in front of your yeah. house. Yeah, yeah. So. Because there is no special parking, so it's hard to find a parking. So you don't have a parking space? No, there is no parking unless, like... Where do you park at night? Um, she has the permit, Judge. Yeah. She has the overnight parking permit. At night, I parked the same oh, parking okay. I got the tickets. Right. during right. the, right. the daytime right. hours with the meters. All right. Are you a student? Yes. Where? Johnson & Wales, the other tickets that I got. <laughs> Where were you studying? And what are you studying? Network engineering. Networking? Oh. You didn't come to court today to network, did you? No. No? Okay. First of all, I'm going to waive the penalties. Okay. And then what I'm going to do with, with the other tickets is, the original tickets were $150. With penalties, it's $350. So I'm going to charge you half of the original tickets, which is $75. Great. I'm reluctant even to do that. You have a student, you know, you're living there, you have an overnight parking pass. You know. So I'm trying to do what I think is just and equitable, taking into consideration the, the position of the city. So I'm going to find you $75. Okay, okay. And I hope that you can get the situation resolved. Thank you so yeah. much. Do you like living up there? Yeah. So, so. You're supposed to say, Judge, I love living in the city. The city's wonderful. <laughs> you know, they have, great, they have great restaurants. They have great quality of life. And most important, Judge, they have a great judicial system. <laughs> And the judges no, are just No, but I got wonderful. in bad situation. First time, they broke my window because they I live in a lot of bars. And the second time, they make a lot of, with the pen pencil stuff on my car. So that's why I have to bark in front of my house, uh, house even though I know I am going to get tickets. They broke into your car? Yeah, my window. They broke my window. I don't know. They didn't steal anything, but I know they might be drunk and said, oh, I'm going to broke it too. You know, you have a very good attitude for somebody that's trying to study here. I'm going to reconsider, but I did. Based on the fact that you had your window broken, it cost you money for that, right? You've done everything you were supposed to do. I'm going to give you a break on this. It's going to cost you nothing, okay? Thank see if you, you can so See much. if you can solve the problem. Thank you so much. All right, good luck to you. Thank you so much. Mm. Some scientists figured out that it takes 37 muscles to frown and only 22 to smile. So why not smile? Tahani used all 22 of her smile muscles brilliantly. She's living proof that a positive attitude leads to positive outcomes. Whereas a bad attitude is like a flat tire. If you don't change it, you won't go anywhere. See, I'm working out 22 muscles at a time. Good morning. Good morning. This is uh, Miss Della Rosa. She has one parking ticket on Spruce Street, an expired meter. Uh, the one on Spruce oh, right. Street, she just um, got off to buy some food for the, the little chickens. In, um, buy food for what? For her um, chickens. Where yeah. does she buy chicken feed? The poultry. Oh, on the plaza. Yes, yes. I, then the, the guy was, um, she waited like a long time. Then when she went to the car, she already had the $25 ticket there. Oh. But does she raise chickens? Usted um, cría pollos. Sí, compré tres pollitos ahí para mi nieto, ahí para que lo miren, ahí vivo y le echo comida. Yes, she bought three of them, like for um, her grandkids. Are these chicks or are these chickens in the backyard? Are these little chicks? Little chicks, yeah. Oh, little chicks. In the backyard. Oh, you tell me that. Oh, yeah, for the, for the grandkids. So she buy food and feed them. Oh. They're not fighting chickens? Wait a minute, Inspector Quinn. Yeah, the, the little chicks are like two weeks old. Oh. Where'd she get these chicks? In the, the, the place, the um, poultry place, I think. Oh, so she bought the chicks there too? Yeah. No, they don't sell. Yeah, she did. And then she, now she's buying the. the, the yes. 
Judge, I've been with you a long time. I don't know where we're going with this one, but <laughs> it is Friday. How old are her grandchildren? ¿Cuánto eh, qué edad tienen sus nietos? Tres años. Uno tiene siete y la otra tiene nueve. Nine, seven, and three. All right. I, I thought she was going to say 27, 35. No. <laughs> no. No. I don't know. I'm going to give her a break. Lo que le van a dar un break con eso se la van a quitar. We're going to make the little chicks happy because if, if I find you. La comida porque se le había terminado y entonces me sentí mal cuando voy a. The little chick didn't have any food, so she went to I buy know. some. They were chirping. I yeah, know. so I know. she felt bad for them. I know. <laughs> if I if I find that she won't buy the chicken food for the little chicks, the little chicks will die. I'll be responsible. I'll feel guilty. <laughs> the little kids won't have chicks to play with. It's just going to be a mess. <laughs> Dice que se lo va a quitar porque si no. Dice que ya yo no vuelvo a comprar comida ahí porque yo me voy a comprar comida. She's not allowed. She's not going to go back to that place to buy the food. She's going to go someplace else. Oh no, I want I want to know something here, right? She's not going to kill these chickens and then get, feed them to the kids, Lugas. right? Usted no va a matar los pollos y dárselo a. Que yo lo voy a matar los pollos cuando estén más grandes. When they are, yeah, when they grow up. Oh no, she ruined the whole thing. <laughs> She's going to kill these chickens. Chicken nuggets, judge. Yeah, and the cold weather. Yes. When, Christmas, so when it gets yes. cold, she's going to kill the chickens. For winter, yeah. <laughs> Inspector Quinn, I'm, I'm now faced with a decision. Either we're going to starve the chickens to death, or she's going to slaughter them. I don't know what's worse. <laughs> well, Franchise the catchatory. That's our last decision oh, to make. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I wish she would have said she was going to. The chickens, I th wish she would have said, these are small chicks that don't grow. All right. I wish you would reconsider and not kill them. But anyway, I'm going to dismiss the case. Okay, All right, so the kids can enjoy it. This is the chicken, the chicken feed defense. First okay. one here in the court. Thank you. Have a good day. All rise and hit subscribe so you don't miss the latest viral moments like this one. Share these videos and weigh in on the cases. You be the judge. Subscribe now.